Elephant in Sri Lankan Buddhist Ceremony Kills Monk A traditional Buddhist ceremony in Sri Lanka went horribly wrong when an elephant in the procession suddenly snapped and unleashed its anger on a monk standing nearby. On the night of June 11th, in a town just north of Colombo, three elephants were walking together as part of a religious ceremony, accompanied by monks and worshippers. Something must have spooked one of the elephants, because out of nowhere, the large animal reportedly broke from the procession and went berserk. A 25-year-old Buddhist monk happened to be in the wrong place at the absolute worst time. He was attacked by the elephant and died hours later. Officials say 127 elephants in Sri Lanka are owned and rented out for festivals or special events. Many of them are kept in inhumane conditions. Backyard elephants have long been seen as a status symbol in the country, indicating wealth, privilege, and power. But Buddhists, really? That doesn't exactly even out, does it? It should come as no surprise that a long enslaved elephant would one day reach its breaking point and then lash out at any human within reach of its trunk. Wouldn't you? Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. You do not want to be around when an elephant gets mad. Don't throw stones at wild elephants. Five people were killed and two others injured when a herd of wild elephants went on the rampage in eastern India. Officials said the pissed off pachyderms attacked villagers who threw stones to try to scare them away. Due to YouTube's guidelines on violent or graphic content, we can't show you the entire thing here, but it's available on our website via the link in the description. Reports said panic spread following separate attacks in rural West Bengal state. The trouble started when a group of elephants wandered into a village on Sunday. Fearing damage to their crops, villagers threw stones in an attempt to shoo the elephants back to the forest. But the move backfired spectacularly, riling the elephants up and putting them on the offensive. A man and a woman, both 60 years old, were trampled to death, while other villagers were gored. Forestry officials were called in and a male elephant died when it was shot with a tranquilizer dart. The other elephants ran back into the forest but later returned with reinforcements and attacked people in a nearby village. A 40-year-old man was picked up and tossed around like a rag doll before being trampled to death. Encounters between people and elephants are on the rise in India due to the destruction of their habitat. Just last month, a wild elephant went on the rampage in the eastern city of Siliguri, but thankfully no one was killed that time. Elephant escapes from circus, kills man in Germany. A man was killed after he was attacked by an elephant that escaped from a circus in Germany on Saturday. A man was killed by an elephant that escaped from a circus in Buchen, Germany on Saturday morning. The victim, a 65-year-old man, was on an early morning walk in the woods collecting bottles and cans when the 34-year-old elephant trampled him to death. The victim's wife went looking for him when he did not return, but found the dead body of her husband instead. Police suspect that the elephant was released intentionally or the cage was not properly locked. The elephant was later captured and returned to the circus. Two incompetent poachers in Zimbabwe's Charara National Park lost a bout with an elephant. Solomon Manjoro and Nolak Tafaruka were planning to poach elephant ivory. Unfortunately for them, their bad aim only scored them one pissed off elephant. The pachyderm chased them down and Manjoro was crushed to death. Park rangers apprehended Tafaruka, who led them to Manjaro's trampled body. The value of elephant ivory has spiked in recent years, bringing poachers out of the woodwork and into Africa's national parks. Say no to safe spaces on YouTube. Support Tomo News at patreon.com slash Tomo News. Randy Elephant takes out sexual frustration by wrecking cars. A heartbroken elephant went on a rampage in a southern China nature reserve last week and mangled 15 cars. This three-ton beast was reportedly vying for the affections of a lady elephant when she scorned him in favor of another. Oh, the heartbreak! <sighs> so instead of taking his love rival to Tusk, he got all crazy trunk and smashed up some cars. Local officials reportedly thought the animal would become playful upon seeing the vehicles, but as you can see, it didn't play out that way. The regional government explained that some tourists had even found the entire ordeal thrilling, interesting, and exciting. Yes, because coming face to face with a sexually aroused rampaging elephant is apparently a routine excursion in the PRC. No one was hurt except the elephant's pride and uh, over a dozen cars. 
What's your take? Did this elephant exercise righteous fury, or was he just being an ear elephant dumbo?